Happy Saturday, everyone. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having a fantastic weekend. My name is Kaylin. If you're new here, welcome. I do arts and craft videos and I also upload design tutorials. So if that's something that interests you, please do consider subscribing to my channel. I would really appreciate it. So in today's video, it's going to be a Silhouette Studio tutorial and I'm going to be showing you how to curve text in Silhouette Studio. So with that being said, let's get right into it. So I have my design here and let's just say I wanted to curve text around my design. What I could do is come over to my shape tool and then draw an ellipse. And this uh, will obviously differ depending on your design and depending where you want your text to go. So I'm gonna make this just a little bit bigger. All right, that looks good to me. Just gonna line it up. You can line, uh, you can align things up in the align panel right on the right hand side here, and then you can align it um, horizontally and vertically. Okay, so now I'm going to type out my text, and on top here I want to say welcome. So I'm gonna type out welcome, and I'm quickly gonna change my font to a more playful font. This font is called Chant. Let's just put it up here. And then I'm going to just fill this in with black so that it's easier for you to see what I'm doing. Okay, now to get it to curve, we're gonna double click on our text. And then you'll see this little circle here with the uh, arrows inside of it, or sorry, the, the little cross inside of it. You can just click and drag your text on the circle and then your text will pop right onto the circle and you can adjust this as you see fit. If you accidentally click off of it, you can just double click on your text again and you can just then adjust this as well. You can also use this slider on the side here and you can uh, push it further away from the circle or you can bring it into the circle. So I'm gonna put it about there. I like that, that looks, that looks good to me. Okay, and then at the bottom, I want it to say, you are. Actually, I'm going to copy this text here, my welcome text, just to make sure that it's the same size. It's just easier to do it that way. So I'm going to just edit this then and I'm going to um, type out you are. All right. And then I want this to go at the bottom. So I'm just going to double click on that and then click on here and then I'm going to drag it onto the circle. So you can see that it's on the outside of the circle. If you want to change that, you just need to drag it a little further in so that it goes, it pops onto the inside of the circle like that. So you might need to play around with this. It can be a little bit tricky. And then I kind of just, I wanna, if you've got your guides on, it will make this easier to align it to the center. Let's just put that in the, in the center. There we go, that looks good. Okay, then I'm just going to use the slider over here to uh, pull it further away from the circle. I think that looks pretty good. And there you have it. How simple is that? That is just the simplest thing ever. You know, I use Illustrator and Photoshop and I always, I mean, okay, I'm not a professional graphic designer, so maybe that's why I really struggle in Photoshop and Illustrator because I just, I, I can, I forget instantly where all the tools are. So I just think that Silhouette Studio is so user-friendly and it's just so much easier. I love, love designing in Silhouette Studio. So that's it. That's how simple that is. And when you go to cut it out, in case you're worrying, don't worry, it's not going to cut the circle out. It's just going to cut your design out. So that is basically it. This is the shortest tutorial I've, I've probably ever done. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed it. It's a little short one from me, but I hope you found it helpful. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next craft video. Bye.